Hello everybody, it's Brian for GadgetUnit.com and in this video I'll be taking a look at Air Server for Windows. It's also available for Mac OS X and what this piece of software allows you to do is mirror your mobile device's display over to your computer. This is a paid piece of software but there is a 7 day free trial available so you can try it out. The consumer license is $15 while the business and educational licenses do vary in terms of cost. I already have it installed and I've been using AirServer for a number of years now, ever since it was released, and it's a pretty convenient piece of software. First, let's go ahead and take a look at the settings screen. Here's the general tab. You can change the name that you want to show up on your mobile device when you're choosing which device you'd like to mirror to. AirServer also supports Miracast mirroring if you have the compatible Wi-Fi adapter. The audio tab allows you to choose your audio output. Display allows you to choose your full screen display output. Mirroring allows you to change the resolution of the video feed that you're getting, depending on the display that you're going to be using it on. Post-processing allows you to adjust the various video effects such as brightness and sharpness and contrast. And the advanced tab allows you to check for updates. So with Air Server running in the background, I'm going to go ahead and connect my iPhone 6 Plus to Wi-Fi. And now I'm going to go ahead and turn on AirPlay mirroring from the AirPlay menu at the bottom and turn the mirroring tab on and here is my iPhone's display being mirrored onto my desktop courtesy of AirPlay mirroring and it works fairly well as you can see here if you're using a newer mobile device Air Server supports 60 frames per second playback which is nice if you're into high frame rate things like that like I am and it also supports auto rotation of your screen so if you adjust the rotation it'll automatically rotate the video feed for you it works very well, and that was just a quick look at Air Server for Windows. Again, this is available for Mac OS X, and it works pretty much exactly the same way. If you have any comments, questions, or feedback about this or anything else, feel free to leave those down below in the comments area. But that's it with the video, so thanks a lot for watching, and I'll talk to you all very soon.